I will be showing you guys today how to change the unsubscription on Active Campaign. So as it is, if you send emails to your customers through Active Campaign and they hit the unsubscribe button, they will be unsubscribed from all lists. So today I'm just going to walk you through a way that you can uh, essentially change it and um, you know make things a little bit more acceptable for them. So usually when it happens it means that you are sending too many emails or the emails are not engaging or not personalized enough and they're not happy with those emails. So today we're going to be fixing this problem and I just thought I would share that with you guys. So, you know, if I go to the actual email and I click and I click unsubscribe, that's what happens. You know, you have been unsubscribed. So you are unsubscribed straight away. The only way that the the customer the contact can you know subscribe again would be if they clicked here and said you know share information so you know you have been uh resubscribed to the list of course nobody does that they just unsubscribe and they're gone forever so we're going to be fixing that by offering them some other options so they can choose what they actually want. In order to do that, you guys will need to have a few different uh, lists. So general updates, newsletter, and special offers. And I'm gonna add myself. I'm gonna add to all three lists that I created. Cool. We're gonna go to forms. We're going to create a new form. Updates. Newsletter. And special offers. Create. You don't need uh, to worry about the full name, so we're going to delete that. We will get the list selector. And we're going to chuck in there. And we're going to change the options and make sure that this is turned off for now um, i'm just going to make sure the other ones are also turned off so we are pretty much done here all we're going to be doing now is hit the integrate button for now i'm going to get the link however if you want you can actually use the embed and you can do something cool like this where you know it can have this page appearing instead of just that to keep it simple today i'm just going to use um, the actual link in here okay so we copy the link we're going to save and exit and we're going to head back to the lists what we're going to be doing now is go advanced settings public pages unsubscribes and we're going to change this to redirect to url instead we're going to paste this here and if we just go to this url what's going to happen is you're going to be able to see the form there which is pretty cool however we don't want the person to need to type their email again so we're going to be doing we're going to be adding a little hack where you know they will not need to enter the email again so it's already going to be there for them so we're going to copy that save and we're going to change that to every single list we have okay so now we're gonna send a test email there you go so we're gonna open this up and we're gonna hit the unsubscribe now and there you go you're gonna have you know the email already there so all you need to do now is select the list that you want and submit and the user will subscribe again to those lists if you want to make it a little bit more fancy you can use something like this so you can have your funnel and then you just chuck inside your funnel the actual form all right guys i hope you have enjoyed it if you have any doubts let me know and we go from there take care have a good one bye bye